Good morning, everybody. It is almost afternoon, actually. I think it might be like 12 o'clock. So either way, it's morning to me because I'm getting my morning routine started. I spent all morning having to clean. So now I'm just getting myself ready for the day. So I have this thing that if I get myself ready before I do any of the housework, I'm not gonna get that housework done because I'm gonna feel all ready and prim and proper. Also, don't mind the ripped up walls. Um, I can repair them and I will. I just haven't gotten around to them yet. So it's okay. I have my toothbrush. <laughs> I've already gone ahead and used some floss. So when I wake up after I take the dogs out, the dogs are my first priority before I even go to the bathroom because we're potty training Daisy, the big one. So if she tries to go potty in the house, no thank you. <laughs> But once we get back inside, then I get to start working on myself if I have no housework to do. I start with a floss, then I brush my teeth. I have very sensitive teeth. So I use the Sensodyne Pro, uh, Pro Enamel. So it's the Intense Enamel Repair. So it looks like that. And you can get them in, I believe, a two pack over at Target. That's where I get everything of mine is Target. So, so anyway, let me go ahead and brush my teeth. Right, now we are going to pick out an outfit for the day. I'm still in debate on whether or not I'm going to take a shower or I'm going to take a bath. Um, since I've got the majority of my work done already, I like taking a bath, but I don't know. And sometimes I like bringing my laptop in there with like a snack or two. Like I really make it a luxurious experience, but I'm not sure what I want to do. I need to stop touching my face. I'm starting to break out. That's bad habit. So... I mean, if I'm staying home all day, I'm not going anywhere. I still want to get ready because if I make videos, <laughs> if I make videos on Instagram that I want to wear makeup, I want to look more presentable. It's a new habit that I'm creating, but what to wear? Taking care of your sister. Taking care of your sissy. We picked out an outfit. Hmm. Yeah, I'll take a bath. <laughs> done with that i'm gonna check insta see if there's anything new going on might post a few things it is so cozy in my home just gotta light some candles and we are set with and a cozy blanket and put on some harry potter and it is the perfect time got these little angels over here ah, i love it oh i love it all right guys so I was ironing. Oh, oh, all my old bags are in here. Hmm. I have two suitcases. Which one? I'll go with. Actually, I don't know. I don't know. I was thinking about doing a live while I was packing and then my anxiety kicked in. I was just like, I don't know what I'm going to talk about. I literally don't like, I want to do a live, but I don't know what I would talk about at all. And I just... I don't want to be boring <laughs> so it's just like oh my god oh my god so i'm like okay we're not doing a live i'm telling myself i was like we're not doing a live we're not ready yet of course it's okay so i'm just gonna vlog and do this so actually i need to find out what the weather is hold on so i called my friend to see what we're gonna be doing on what days she got a house and she's renovating it so i'm gonna be helping her but i'm like what day am i gonna be helping you do all this painting. I don't know. I don't know. She didn't pick up. So I'm like, okay, well, what clothes am I going to need? So I got to plan this out, I think. Oh, I tell you, I was this close to going to bed with makeup on. That's probably why I'm breaking out. Like, and then I have a little area up here that's starting. Love it. As I was packing, I put on how to lose a guy in 10 days. That was a big mistake because I ended up just sitting here and watching it <laughs> instead of packing. Packing to me is very stressful because I'm like, okay, well, what am I going to need? And I don't know exactly what my schedule is going to look like on this trip. 
So I was like, okay, well, I don't want to overpack, but I don't want to underpack. So I went hopefully somewhere in the middle, maybe a tiny bit over by like two t-shirts. Besides that, I think I'm ready besides putting my makeup and skincare, skincare <laughs> in there. Another really big thing happened tonight and I was going nuts. Like it just baffles me that this even happened. So one of my absolutely favorite YouTubers, Exo McKenna, I posted a, a video on my story today and I was talking about tips on how to make your home feel more fall. And on one of them, I included her, I tagged her in it and I didn't think that anything would happen because she's really big, right? A lot of people follow her, she's probably really busy. So I was like, okay, well, people can click on her and see the amazing stuff that she does. But through that post, I get a notification and it said that she shared my story. And I was like, what? What? Like, what? Is this happening? I was just losing my mind. It's just insane. I was not expecting that. So, I mean, I had a fantastic night and I'm like, I'm over the moon. I really am. I really, really am. I'm just like, <laughs> okay. Good morning. It's the next day. Took the dogs on a walk. Oh, did somebody come to visit? Hello, Miss Daisy. Thank you. This is her corner. She loves this corner right in front of the sink. And then Mr. Tops. <laughs> My husband and I, we made breakfast. It was delicious. And now I'm going to do my normal teeth routine. So floss, then brush, wait a few minutes. I've already picked out my clothes. So I kind of defeated the waiting process a little bit, but that's okay. Then we're going to put whitening in before we go and take a shower. Before I get started, I know I'm in yesterday's clothes, but it's because I don't want to put on new clothes when I wake up, but I don't want to go out in PJs. So I just throw on yesterday's clothes before I because I'm gonna be taking a shower later. And I just do that, saves laundry. I mean, I could wear new clothes when I take the dogs out, but I feel like that defeats the purpose when it comes to taking a shower because you wanna be cleaning the new clothes you got. But anyway. have a list it's because of the whitener have the majority of my makeup on just not my lips i'm gonna film something on insta because people have been asking me what combination i do to create my lip color when i do it i just use lipstick i don't use anything special for people to ask me this i'm like oh well yeah it's it's not what you're technically supposed to do. <laughs> Usually you use like a lip liner and then you go in with a lipstick and then a lip gloss. But for me, it's just like, I go in with a normal lipstick on the outside. Then on the inside, I go in with more of a suede lipstick that's liquid. And then I go in with a lip gloss because when I first saw people, it was back when Kylie lip kits were big they were first coming out people were just raving about it they're like oh i need to get like a lip liner and stuff and i was like they're expensive <laughs> so i had to be creative and through that creativity i was like well i'll just use a dark lipstick to give that effect i've tried using lip pencils but i'm just more comfortable using a lipstick so, I mean, go with what you're comfortable, right? So if you're new to dry shampoo, you basically just put it on as if it is hairspray on your roots, and then you rub it in as if you are washing your hair in the shower. So update, took the dogs to the dog park for an hour or two, something like that. Come back home, dropping off the dogs because we're dropping my husband's vehicle off over at his parents. His dad 
works on cars. He does a great job. Well, he goes to start it and he hasn't driven it in a few months. So it's dead. It's not starting up. Well, we end up having to jump his vehicle. So it's working. I'm driving behind it right now. But I'm like, okay, best of luck. It's an old car, well over 20 plus years old, and it runs fine. It's just old. So I'm thinking about turning his car into my car because it's got great gas mileage, honestly. And I, I like driving older cars. I think they're cute and I love the challenge of making something old look new and clean. Also, it's an easy car to fix. I've had my fair share of vehicles being too difficult to fix. So to have maybe like a Lego car would be nice. I know it's so easy to get caught up in, oh, look at how pretty and brand new my car is. Because I mean, my goal is one day to have like a Rolls Royce, a Maserati and an Infiniti. I mean, that's, that's my goal. That's on my dream board. But is it good for me right now? No. I need something that's going to get me from point A to point B. I don't care what it looks like. As long as I keep it clean, that's all that matters. So we're waiting at Culver's. I got a chocolate shake and we're going to get our... <laughs> See, this is why I don't record around you. I know. That's why I do this. No. Okay, okay. You're waiting for something and I know it. Guys. <laughs> We're home. We had Culver's and now we're just relaxing for the rest of the night. I'm going to play some power wash simulator. Got Toby laying over here in the back. Everything ended up working out at the end of the day. So we're getting his car worked on. And I talked to one of my friends and we discussed the future and how exciting things are looking. And with that, I think I'm going to end this vlog. So... I hope you guys had a really great day. If not, tomorrow's a new opportunity. Hey, this evening, the second is a new opportunity. And I hope only the best for you guys. So remember, be kind and have courage. And on to the next one. Here we go.